Of safety before kids return to school tomorrow after a high school student was killed after Friday's basketball game at Tri-Cities High School. Our Erica Murphy is live for us. Erica, in the last half hour, we were able to verify some new information about the student who was killed, Mario Bailey. That's exactly right, Christy. Um, we did learn that new information. And this is, let me just say that this is a terrible, terrible tragedy and it's impacting several families. I've been uh, just spending some time in between live shots here, just kind of scouring Facebook and I found many tributes to Mario. Now we know that right after a basketball game here between Tri-Cities High School and Banneker, there was some kind of fight and one person was stabbed right here on the school's property, but there was another person who was shot nearby. Now, both of these cases, police are saying they're not sure if they're related. Um, East Point is investigating one and the Fulton County Schools is investigating the other. And we learned that one person who was attacked and critically injured was 15-year-old Mario Bailey. Mario died from his injuries. Now, according to a GoFundMe launched for Bailey, it says that he was an ROTC student who worked part-time all while being a success here at school. We did check in with a local activist who works with youth to curb violence and he says it is going to take a community effort to change things. And it's going to take all of us from the teachers to the coaches to the elected officials, the community leaders and stakeholders and organizations like myself to work together. And uh, Derek Townsend says that he is visiting far too many families and helping so many people uh, who have been impacted by this violence. We also know that Tri-Cities uh, principal sent uh, a letter out yesterday, and it was to parents and students, of course, you know, informing everyone of uh, Mario Bailey's passing and also offering some tools for parents whose kids may be negatively impacted by this death. Um, there will also be some school counselors here on site, which is important because school um, does resume tomorrow morning. Back to you.